Good day and welcome everyone to our news today. The 36-year-old is due to spend the weekend in Nottinghamshire at the end of the year to lead planning for next year's military veterans with Invictus Games in Holland. He will then pay a visit to his grandmother, the Queen, before flying back to his home in California. It was not known last night whether he will also make time to see his brother, Prince William. But while he is likely to leave behind his wife, Meghan, 40, and their children, Archie, 2, and baby Lilibet in their 11 million pounds Montecito mansion, the Duke of Sussex will not be traveling alone. The source said he will be flanked by a small film crew at his addresses participants at Stanford Hall, the Army's Rehabilitation Center for Wounded Soldiers. The crew, employed by Archwell Productions, will be filming as part of a £100 million deal struck last year between Netflix and the Sussex's Archwell Productions. Archwell Foundation to produce Heart of Invictus, a documentary on the games. It will be directed by British documentary maker, a team already credited with an Academy Award for their short film The White Helmets and a BAFTA for Virunga, set in the Congo's Virunga National Park. Archwell Productions was formed by the couple last year to utilize the power of storytelling to embrace our shared humanity and duty to truth through a compassionate lens. Prince Harry has severed all official ties to Britain's military with his decision to quit royal duties. But the veteran, who served two tours in Afghanistan, remains passionate about the Invictus Games, which he established in 2013 after witnessing the U.S. similar warrior games for veterans with physical and mental disabilities. In 2019, biographer Angela Levin revealed, One of the things he said to me, though, was that he was in a big rush to make changes and to do something that's really valuable. Because, he said, all too soon George and Charlotte will be hogging all the films. But signs of Sussex fertig are already emerging. Polling by Yul Gav has revealed that Prince Harry's popularity ratings here have plunged 50 points since 2017, when he was Britain's favorite royal after the Queen to second to bottom, above controversy driven Prince Andrew. Separate research into Google Trends Online by Top 10 Casinos last week revealed Meghan Markle has seen an 18.6% decrease in online searches, while the Duchess of Cambridge has seen a 50% increase. Since their split for the royal family, the couple has embarked on a raft of lucrative media projects, including a podcast with audio streaming service Spotify, an Apple TV Plus series The Me You Can't See, a children's book called The Bench, and an animated family series called Pearl. Last month, Harry confirmed he was penning a memoir, ghost written by Pulitzer-winning journalist and writer J.R. Moringer, which would be an accurate and wholly truthful account of his life to date. The four-book deal with Random House is said to be worth £40 million to the couple. And that brings us to the end of the news today. Hope you enjoy it. Please click the like and subscribe to our news channel for more. Thanks for listening and stay safe everyone. Have a nice day.